Bully fam, bully fam, TBK West back with another video. Today we're gonna be going to take the kids to go do a few things and then also we're gonna check out these dogs, man. Um, I guess I'll show y'all Trinity, man. She been acting real funny. Like I don't know if they're gonna come early or not, but we'll see. Um, what else? Um, my boy Blue Sant. I guess we can show y'all my boy Blue Sant since you know his first litter is on the way, man. I'm real proud of him, man. It's a great dog. I bred him, as y'all know. Uh, still have his mom. Uh, his dad is in California at a ranch. Um, yeah, man. So y'all stay tuned to the next scene, man. You see who we got right here? We got Miss Trinity. Hey, y'all. I didn't know she had red eyes, man. If y'all take a look, you see those brown eyes. Red eyes, bro. I ain't know, but yeah, it's a real deal. My man was not lying. Lilac and blue makes chocolate. This dog definitely carries chocolate, man. Let's see, we got my girl Cardi right here with her, chilling. You see, she might be just a little bit shorter than Cardi. But Cardi is definitely a little more compact. But, you know what I'm saying? We waiting for Cardi to... This probably be her last go around, y'all. We, we gonna retire Cardi after this. So, you know. We gonna see her in action. We gonna hear about it. This is my girl Trinity's first litter. She's, this is day 56. Or 57, one of those. For those who just got to the channel, she has about eight pups in there. Um, I bred her to my boy Blue Sign. Uh, if you don't know, he is a blue Merle. Show him on the screen probably right about now. Um, yes, sir. Uh, he's off of Tucson and it's Cardi. This is his mom right here. If y'all didn't know, Cardi is Tucson. I mean, Blue Sun's mom. Also, Maya's mom. And this is the uh, my foundation female. She is the face of the kennel she is on the logo so yeah we're getting ready to breed her to a fluffy and uh yeah man just a regular day at the camp the sun is going down it's been a little windy lately you know the weather scattered showers leaves falling cold every other night it's like cold fronts every other night. It's not really that crazy, but yeah, y'all. So it's just a little update. Let y'all see what's going on. You see those milk bags getting huge, getting huge. Yeah, buddy. Back to this beautiful female right here. I booger off. Yes, sir. And uh, yeah, y'all, I haven't been posting that much because I just basically been getting ready for this litter to drop. Um, you know, just preparing. You know, we got a whole bunch of things coming. So just want to make sure everything's right. I want to make sure that I got everything that I need when I need it, you know what I'm saying? That's all. Working on a whole lot of things, man. Definitely got some, I'm gonna I'm make some investments and I'm gonna take y'all with me on that. My investments are gonna be, you know, something that just makes money in your sleep type stuff. I am interested in like going with some type of storefront, but for the most part, the investments that I make are like, either turnkey or something that's just gonna make money in your sleep type stuff so I will be making one of those type of investments soon so I'll be you know showing y'all step by step as we do it you know what I'm saying so y'all know I dropped the sauce man you know I give y'all some game you know I dropped them gems you know what I'm saying <laughs> yeah man I got a lot more gems to drop too Taking my time. 
You know what I'm saying? We drop them when they right, when they appropriate. I've been blessed to have access to a breeder who's been breeding for 20 years. And also it's a blessing that he'll answer the phone every time I call. And man, doing that, bro, it's really like a cheat code, man. You really, you know what I'm saying? You can really skip levels if you got somebody you can call to help you with all types of stuff. And the reason why I'm saying that is because this man has told me all types of stuff that I never knew. You know what I'm saying? For example, like, it's something you can give your dog that's over the counter at Walmart and stuff like that. That if she's supposed to come in heat, it will guarantee that she'll come in heat. And it's not no heat shot or no shit like that. It's a vitamin. So, stuff like that, man. It's like 20 years worth of game right there, man. That he done blessed me with on di different subjects and shit. And I don't know it all, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, learn as you go. Got some more gems to drop for y'all. Some more sauce. You know, the how-tos, that's that's nothing. Those going to keep coming. We got more how-tos coming. Because, like I told y'all on my other video, <clears throat> and also for my new um, breeders and new YouTubers, you're going to have to, like, reiterate. You know what I'm saying? You're going to feel like you're being redundant, saying the same shit all the time, but... Everybody, you get new followers all the time, man. You just got to give them that info, bro. Drop it again, man. For those who are dogs, breeders, they want to know details. You know, I mean, I'm not going to lie, man. I don't recommend you bring your dog outside this late. She really should just be using the restroom in the house. You know what I'm saying? But, you know. I'll bring her out for y'all because my environment is safe. Um, she is, she used to be a little more wilder, like she do some crazy stuff. You know, I had a dog named Cindy where a Frenchie, and she would be wild while she was pregnant. And, you know, I used to see my buddy over at Royal Kingdom Bullies, uh, my brother uh, Dre, he wouldn't let his females out like he'll have them in the travel cage not even in a regular cage because he wouldn't risk them hurting themselves or maybe have hurting the pups or something you know what i'm saying and i understand why because when i was breed i had makita this is an exotic well i guess yeah you could just say she's a pocket bully she's not exotic but makita i let her out she was i forgot what day she was on she was probably on day 50 something right and uh i let her out and i let all the other all the other dogs out and they kept jumping on her and then it made her get real nervous and then she started shivering and shit and i was like damn why are you shivering 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 came in the house and then she started pushing and i realized that the stress had induced an early pregnancy so, you know, I see and understand why, you know, some people might be cautious. Like I said, do not bring your female out in public or let her play with the other dogs while she's pregnant. Because like I said, too much stress can uh, induce the pregnancy early, man. So that's my tip for the day, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Appreciate y'all for tapping in. Appreciate all the likes and comments. It's TBK West. Trilateral Bully Camp. And we out of here. Gone.
Okay, I wasn't recording, but as y'all can see, I just got a strike. My oldest daughter, she just got one ball, I mean one pin left. But look, you see that X right there? Yeah, strike, baby. 